Alright, there are a few more people that I need to talk to here in uh, the southern part of town that need leaflets, like you. And that gives me nine. And this person gives me ten. You give me... You are not the person that I wanted to talk to. Shut up. You... Give me eleven, I believe. Just take the handout, please. And then I do... Am I at eleven? <gasps> Hold on, I think I actually need twelve. Hold on while I try to find the last person. I was wrong! I only did need eleven. So, I did everybody during the day, and it's back into town at night. We have a few things that we need to do here. First off, let's talk to this person that's trying to, to dodge me down here. The heck is this? It's Chicken Scratch. I'll take one for laughs. And that is 12. I'm off to see the Master Bouts, you know, the one at the arena at Grand's Castle. Screw you, dude. I used to be in those. I'm too excited to sleep. Good for you. Uh, now, we are looking for... Someone new outside town. Is it you? Yes. Will you quit pacing back and forth? Leaflets, I'll take one. Will you buzz off? What do you say? Do I intimidate you or what? All right, that is 13. Just two more to go. What are you doing wandering around so late? What, me? What about me? <laughs> Just like wandering around, that's all. Something wrong with that? that? There is something wrong with that. So, we are pretty much done in this part of town, even at 9, except that we need to come in here for something completely different. Oh, a cutscene. A realm soldier? Uh-huh. I'm pretty sure he was looking for me. This is for the other side quests that we're doing. I was wrong, there are only four side quests. Technically, they're considered the same side quests, the, uh, the dwarves and the knife. Uh, I thought there were two separate ones, to be honest with you. Mister, the walls have ears. This one's with the realm. We're done for. We're not done for. Even in the darkest night, there's light. That's no help. And that's that's pretty much all we got. Can I go back in and talk to you guys now? What's up, dude? You have anything new to say? No. <laughs> Even though I just like eavesdropped in, he he doesn't want to say anything new. Oh, jeez, this is a long dialogue tree anyway. Uh, but yeah, he doesn't have anything new to say. That is very, very disappointing. Now, I believe that uh, we only need two more to go in terms of the leaflets. However, there is only one person more that we can talk to here at night. Now, this is going to be the first time that we're actually going to need to do anything other than morning or day and night. We actually need to come here during the evening. Whoa, what the hell happened over here? Whatever it is, I'll take it. Oh, what's that there in your hand? Give me one quick. Mm, it's the spot. What, the piece of paper? How refreshing. My thanks to you for your kindness. The hell is he on about? Dude. Huh, I ate a leaflet? You must be joking. <laughs> Would anything that tasty be a leaflet? You're a lifesaver. I don't... I don't understand you at all, man. <laughs> you ate my piece of paper and now you're alive. So that's actually it for uh, the night here. Uh, we actually need to leave town and come back during the evening. Uh, which uh, kind of looks kind of yellowish. Um... That's going to be a little tricky for me, so I will figure out how to get here at evening, and I'll be right back. And like I thought that was a little bit tricky, what I ended up needing to do was use a magic rope uh, to get back to town once it was evening, because evening was an odd number of time intervals slash screens away, uh, so it was very hard for me to leave and then come back and make it evening. Uh, this is the only person that is here that we need to talk to specifically in the evening, it is you hanging out right by the fountain. Soldier! Hanging out leaflets, you are industrious. Why don't you just give. Why don't you just say you gave them out and just chuck them? And that's what I do. <laughs> Serious. Hard working types like you really crack me up. But we have gotten rid of all of them. Do you have anything interesting to say since you have a name? Now you're just a Wendell grandfather, apparently. Uh, thanks for the uh, unusual ad. And that's all he has to say. But we have completed our work. Is, um, 
Is the guy at the inn during the evening? He is! We completed your quest as well, Umberto. What's wrong? You look different. Did you find something? Y yes, yes I did. Good job! Lead the way! It'll look suspicious if I walk with you. You go ahead, I'm right behind you. Alright, let's take him there and then uh, hopefully they give me the option of kicking his ass instead of uh, letting him punish the mana followers for being heretics. That would be bad! Alright, let's walk in here. And there they are. Now tell him, tell, like, run, get out of here! Ah, no, he followed me. Finally got them. I never thought we'd find them here. Darn, I knew we'd get sold out to the realm. Calm down, Arnold. Don't despise people. Come what may, never hate anyone. I've been looking for you, uncle. What? What? It's me, Umberto. I was undercover as a realm soldier gathering information. Oh, right, it's you, Umberto. This is Umberto. I'm like a mentor to him. Good to see you again after all this time. No time to be laughing. We've got to get out of here. They'll be right on our heels. You've got that right. We can't trust townies. They'd sell us out for the reward. This place is crawling with people like that. Shut up! It's part of my side quest. No, I'm not budging. I'm the point man for the resistance. I need to stay here to keep up morale. Yeah, but what if word gets out? We can't be sure. Spies are all around and they might talk. Nobody wants to talk to me about all this, though. I, uh... You don't have to say a word. I understand everything. No, you don't, really. You really don't. Umberto. How many adventurers did you send to look for me? This is the only one I talked to. The others all ran off before I could ask. They probably did. Not many people dare to talk to you in a get up like that. You're ugly in that, I guess. Strength, confidence, and ironclad will without them. Who dare to talk to realm soldiers? Someone who wanted to trade info for cash? Even a child knows those people don't keep their promises. A repressed world, a shallow peace. If we want change, we will face danger. Am I right or not? I guess you are right. Well, I suppose so. I've got it! I'll return to my unit, and I'll send back whatever info I can. Yeah, do your best, but be careful about it. Do I still get my money? Speaking of info, several dissidents have arisen among the ranks, and persecution has relaxed some. But I don't think it's as dangerous for any of us now. Dissidents in the ranks. Are they reckless, or are they fools? Well, Uncle, take care of yourself now. You were supposed to give me money! I don't know who you are, but... I guess you're okay. Sorry I doubted you. I'll give you this. I'm not sure what you'd use it for, but consider it a token of friendship. And I received Dudbear's gold! Which is definitely a special item, but we'll go over those later. I told you so. Realm soldiers don't pay what they say. I don't know what they owe you, but you can kiss it goodbye. <laughs> oh, that does not sound good at all. All, so I'm not getting my money. Uh, but we did pick up a new item, a very important item. I believe it is an event item. There it is. Dudbear's gold. It's Dudbear's branded gold. Uh, we will uh, go over that when it becomes important. But you want as many of those as you can get. Now, uh, we can head back to the general store and tell him that we have completed handing out all of his leaflets. You give them all out? Love overachievers. Here's your pay, 440 lucre. Stop by and visit again sometime. And we received another Dudbear's Gold. Now, we have completed all four side quests that we can do right now in the town of Wendell. So, I am going to go back to 
the hot house and talk to little cactus and we can see what he has to say about all this all right we're back in the hot house with little cactus and i have talking talking wow what is that i have talked to him four times you actually have to talk to him once for each quest that you have accomplished that you want him to write a little story about so i talked to him once left talk to him again left talk to him again and so on until it's time to read all the little stories that he has done. I have done quest 18. This is the first of the side quests they do start at 18. General store ads. I so thought this quest was a bore. Chief passing out ads for the store. Though everyone seed them, nobody would read them, and all was the same as before. I like that one. That was nice. We helped out some guy in a pinch and snagged him some goodies a cinch. But I'm guessing the lesson we need was he conned or a true friend indeed. Now this is the one for the glittering sword. You do want to do this one now. You don't have to. Uh, but this opens up some later side quests. So you want to accomplish this one as soon as you can so that the other ones will be opened up for you. We've also completed number 21, the silver knife with the dwarfs. I've noticed how dwarfs consist mainly of beards. Do you think if you shaved one he'd just disappear? Personally I think he'd be a gnome, but that's just me. And then we've also completed number 23, Soldier's Orders, the last one that we had completed there. Uh, the uh, the one with the informant, I guess you could say, got close to a shifty-eyed guy and found inside him an ally. But for all the suffering and pain, we fell far short of fiscal gain. Yeah, we did. But we did get gold, which is always nice. And that is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Sword of Mana. I've been Baller Scuba. When we come back, I will be back in Wendell, and we can actually continue the plot. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.